Hello everyone, Phoenix Father here, and welcome back to another Farming Simulator 17 Mod Spotlight. Now, I'm sorry if this one is a little bit, um, I don't know the word for it. Uh, a, I think I'm getting sick. I am, I feel like crap right now. Uh, I'm, I'm burning up, so I'm pretty sure I'm catching some sort of cold. Secondly, I'm not in the greatest of moods because, uh, friends. Um, and third, uh, I thought I had this recorded and I didn't, so I'm recording this at like 3 o'clock in the morning after I've had about 4 hours sleep total within the past 24 hours. So, um, forgive me if I'm if it's not the greatest of videos. So first off, let's start off with this claw. Look. Claws? Clap. People, I've gotten contradictions on how to pronounce it. Some people say class. Some people say Klaus. I don't know what it is, but I, I've always been a fan of these tractors. I guess it's because it's the, it's the lime green. I don't know. But every, as far as back as 13, I've uh, I've been a really huge fan of these tractors. Now let's start off first with the left control Y. You can change the steering. How many different ones it has? <laughs> oh, this steering. Wait. Oh yeah, there you go. Oh, left control Y, I hit. There we go. Let's leave it the steering for now. Um, change driving direction. This is awesome right here. This whole animation, just awesome. And now, oh, you can't move while you're doing it. That's awesome. And now we can drive this way. Pretty awesome. Um, that horn uh, beacon works. All right, there's a couple different options for this one. Let's head on over here. Customize. Get the four thousand, the forty-five hundred. And the 5,000. Let's go with 5,000. Uh, wheel setup. Twin wheels. Let's go with the biggest twin wheels. How about that? Customize. Yes. Darn tootin'. Oh, we're gonna have to rotate this back. I'm sorry. It doesn't just come with the tractor. Oh, wait. It's looking for B. Why did I hit X? It doesn't just come with the um, tractor. It actually comes with. The, those trailers over there, which I'm going to show you here in a minute. As soon as we get turned around, turned around, turned around, turned around, and drop. Lights. All kinds of lights. Alright, so let's. Back it up here. comes with this trailer and then it comes with three different uh, spread or sprayer trailers I just bought the biggest one because why not uh, it's actually separate you buy the, the trailer and the, the sprayer separately so I guess you can haul, use it for hauling as well as uh, just just spraying it's pretty cool anyway let's get the main reason we bought it for let's head on over here Poor combine's probably full by now. And open the cover. Now a lot of people were asking where where I got certain mods that are in the server. Some people actually thought the mods the servers and the mods were private. They're all free free to download, guys. They're all available. Uh, I probably just haven't covered them in Mod Spotlight yet. Uh, this was one of them. Uh, oh, there we go. 
uh, that was one of them and uh, it's been available it's not private or anything and if you guys don't want to wait for the mod spotlights they are available in the downloads for uh, the server I have the download link for all the mods in the server available for download every single week in any stream we do uh, for um, any stream we do for farming sim. So for future reference, if you want a certain mod that I haven't covered yet, uh, and you've seen it in live streams, it's available in the live stream pack. Let's open this up. Wow, it's dirty already. <coughs> <coughs> Let's go ahead. I forgot to cover what this tractor has. This combine is pretty awesome. It looks great. It comes with a corn. Well, it, it's a separate download, but it comes with a corn head that's you use with it. That's pretty awesome too. The only thing I see that could that anything is that the pipe is see through, which. You know, people probably didn't think you'd be able to see that from there, but you can. Uh, and there's no animation whatsoever to it, so what you see is what you get. Uh, it doesn't fold in or anything, so that's that's a bummer. That'd be nice to have it fold up, but ain't no big thing. It takes forever to <laughs> unload too, so we're gonna go. We're gonna go. Uh, let's do. Let's do this beast pickups real quick. I think this is the right pickup. Yes, it is. This thing is a beast. I don't probably don't have a trailer to pull with it. Ah, we can pull this trailer. Why not? This is color changeable too as well. So you can change colors in it. That's, I think it's the only option that comes with. What kind of want to fill it up and see if it? Not a problem. Truck's pretty awesome. This truck is awesome as well. Um, the only thing I see wrong is how far the wheels turn out. Uh, and it also has the plow attachment. For those of you guys who are into snow plowing, this thing does have the snow plow attacher to it. You can hook a plow to the front of it. It doesn't come with any, so you have to use ones from another a mod or, or a pack of some sort. But it does hook up. I don't have them in. I only selected the ones I was going to do in the video to make it a little bit easier on me to find them throughout the menu. Skirt. All right. So yeah, that's that's that one. <laughs> Wanted to get to this. This is now. The last one I did, literally right after I did the, the <laughs> video on it, and I had it scheduled and uploaded, they put out the auto load version, which was awesome. Now this is one I've edited up for the server. I don't have the original one anymore. They actually made a, a day cab and work. Z. There we go. Why is that one not there? That's weird. But yeah, they literally put out the the auto load version right after I put out that video. So um, 
yeah, it's pretty awesome. I love it. Now, like I said, this was the one I've edited up for the server. Once again, it's available on the server if you want the purple with the less shinier chrome. Um, if you want the the uh, standard one, that's the one that's going to be in the link down below. Um, so yeah, there you go. <laughs> yeah, it's we. It's easier for this to you hook up to this and go haul bales instead of the the truck and trailer. Um, a little bit easier to park away and everything so that's why I got this especially when I'm work on the cows just fire this up load the bales head on over here bingo bongo bingo anyway uh, is this done unloading yet or is it full maybe no it's not okay so let's test this out see if it works And it does the overloader. Well, the blue one anyway. Uh, the yeah, the red one. I know it works because we've been using it for the past couple weeks. Ever since it came out, the blue one we haven't used, which I want to get in the habit of, instead of having the truck come out. Just run this thing in here. Somebody was actually hauling this red one around in Friday's stream, and it's like, whoa, no, no, because once this thing gets so heavy, you ain't pulling it anywhere. It's not designed to be pulled anywhere. It's supposed to be like set up on the side of the field, and you dump, you dump into it, and then dumps in the truck. So, we anyway, let's drop this trailer, and head back here to check all the tractors options. If you guys are wondering why I'm not doing the rating system, I'm done with the rating system. I'm done with the stupidity that comes with it. Um, it's just not worth it so I'm just gonna keep it the way it is right in this video where I'm just showcasing the mods not freaking give them a rating get pissing people off it's just not worth it I've had the week I don't didn't do the mod spotlight which is last week I had no drama laden comments so uh, it was it was absolutely nice, and I'm going to keep it that way. So customize, we get the 9460RT, 9510RT, 9560RT. Let's go with the 9560, yeah, there we go. Same thing, just beefier engine, different logos on it. All right, let's drop out there. Um, let's do these mowers real quick, because I know people are going to want, want these mowers. Hit up here. Oh yeah! Wow, this thing takes off quick. Oh, yeah. oh man! Cut more than I wanted it to. That's weird. That on <laughs> that one cut way further over than that one that was weird or did it I don't know that's weird stop in this one boom let's hop in the last one And I'll cut. So that's that pack. It's all one pack, so you guys only have one download. Uh, really nice. I really like them. Same as I did in 13. And let's do this one too. This was supposed to be something, somehow, log cutter. I'm not sure if I missed a piece or not. Because I don't know, it was supposed to cut down trees, but apparently I didn't do that right. But you can also hook a mower to it. It's cool because look at your guy behind it. It's supposed to be like a, a robo cut. You cut down, it's a robot you send up to cut the tree down. It's pretty cool. Uh, like I said, you can hook a mower to it. You can hook anything with a three point attacher to it, I would assume. Let's try that. I don't have anything over here that's three point attached, do I? pretty awesome little thing 
Uh, let's head on over here. I'm trying to get everything I have here so somebody's not like, where's that? Where's that? Alright. So let's discon disconnect that. So over here, I know this whole thing's not gonna connect. Prepare headphone users. This tractor is super loud. <laughs> if you're not expecting it, it will get you. There it is. Startup's good. But the running sound is super loud. Never mind. We're going to drag it anyway. Never mind. No, we ain't. <laughs> For some reason, this has the lock there, but it's not locking. Let's see if we can get a smaller tractor on there. This tractor here has no special features whatsoever to it. What you see is what you get, and that's it. Let's see if we can hop in that one. Yeah, there we go. I'm on fire! Literally, my, my body feels like I'm just sitting inside a fireplace. It's just... I'm roasting here. For some reason, it's not wanting the falls through. No way to... Yeah, it's pretty... Pretty pointless if you can't get a... Tractor on there. It pulls it. <laughs> the truck, it looks a lot like the end game truck. I could be wrong. I think I am wrong. I don't know. I'm going to night still. Oh! Whoops. Alright, let's jump in. This one up here and take the Dakota trailer. This is a different Dakota trailer than the one. I was in the last one. There we go. Lower? Oh, there we go. Pipe out. Seems legit. <laughs> Seems totally legit. I love how it f actually fills. Wish this tractor had a little more oomph to it. 
Just a little bit more. Did I, did I see that right? Did it unload only from the front? That would be awesome because if we dumped it majority of it in the front. That would actually be awesome. So you saw that. Now I have discovered a problem with this bed. They create this bed for the, the same truck we use the auto load trailer on. Um, or attacher on. Uh, they use the same truck. Again, the bed... the bed's been edited up there is a problem if you want to use it for cutting corn uh, it will not like it, the the uh, the forage harvester recognizes it but it won't actually offload into it so I don't know what's going on there kind of sucks so that's the main reason I put it in the server for it to help JT out when he's uh, cutting corn. And it works. I think that's about it. We've covered everything else, haven't we? I believe so. So yeah, folks, that's <laughs> that's all there is. I'm so, again, I'm sorry uh, for the overall tone of this video. I'm just not feeling well. Not the greatest of moods. And screaming tired. So that's going to do it. If you liked the video, be sure to leave a like down below. If you guys want to see future mod spotlights, be sure to click subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.